Yes. So, uh, small thing about me, Richard Riga working for uh, Bliss Digital as a Plow Part Flame Lead, I have the Fast Track Recognized Solution Architect title. And if you want to link with me, my LinkedIn is right there below. And uh, I'm going to talk about a little solution we built for uh, a customer of us. We, it was a full code development project and they wanted to implement some features that we're going to take a quite a bit of time and money to implement it because there was no CMS inside the current solution. They were developing a, a web application which was completely with dynamic data, which was in a database. So uh, why we chose a fusion development for that, combining the worlds of low code developers and full code developers. And um, by using low code in our full code and full code in our low code solution. So the scenario was a full code project with a responsive mobile app and all the data was dynamic. Uh, based on the logged in user, there was no CMS available and the owner of the application wanted certain specialists to create uh, tips or services or specialist information for their customers. And later on, they wanted also to display notifications inside the application and wanted an easy way to create those notifications. So all this was designed for through a designer in Figma and we created a canvas app around that with workflows between uh, gathering and saving the data from uh, SharePoint. Uh, and every now and then the workflows were also syncing data from Power BI and a custom API to the uh, database that was the backend for the web application. All the roles for the, for the solution were stored in Power BI and also all the Um, there was through, were some workflows so syncing the data from, from Power BI and from the custom API, which was also uh, full code development uh, part. So I will shortly demo the solution to you. So when you started the app, any user Every user doesn't have access to the SharePoint site, so because they're, the users were external users, but they still wanted to do it through a Canvas app. When you open the app, you will get your own uh, block types. Sorry for the Dutch, because it's a, we're a Dutch company, so the solution is all in Dutch. Um, you can have, you have a live view of the the block type you're editing, and every time you change something, it's life changing inside the preview. You can also change the images in it. So if I select another header, it will automatically change the header inside the preview. When you save it later, it will sync to the custom API. Because the uh, live view uses an HTML part, I had to do some finicky stuff with um, the changement, changing of the images. So I had to do a JSON around the image that you upload and set that inside the HTML preview window. And for the notifications, it's a bit of the same stuff. All the data is stored in SharePoint lists with uh, a JSON file, which is then synced to the custom API. And that's all through different uh, workflows which are triggered through the Power App or uh, on a schedule. So that's some all I had to show you.